Macbeth and the Beanstalk takes two of theatre's favourite tales and puts them together. The result is a heady mix of music and madness. Jack comes to Macbeth's castle um, in search of uh, wealth and um, you know, Macbeth still kills the former king of Scotland. The dame is the murderously minded Lady Macbeth and as the black comedy unfolds, even the pantomime cow comes a cropper. Jack's cow unfortunately gets turned into some kind of um, dog food uh, eventually, but that doesn't happen on stage. Um, the effects for that would be quite expensive. Um, no, there's, there's plenty of, I mean, there's a, there's a fair amount of killing, certainly. Um, but then there is a happy ending. What's all this about occult premonitions on an imperial theme? Shouts of he's behind you will probably be ignored, and the cast won't be throwing sweets into the audience. So if you believe in the link between clapping and fairies, this show's not for you. It's not for little kids, it's, it's for adults and sort of older teenagers, I suppose, you know. Um, but I mean, this humour's bound to be black, really, because it's a story about murder. Macbeth and the Beanstalk runs until January the 17th. Nicky Finlay, Channel One, Islington. There might be a happy ending, but there's a 